this is iPod Tutorial Dudes, and today I'm going to show you how to get the next SB settings, which um, it's just basically the same thing that I would use instead of SB settings because um, it's a way that it integrates it into your notifications center, therefore it uses less RAM or memory, and your iPod will be less likely to crash. Now all you have to do is search NC Settings in Cydia. It's just a Mai. This is the current version. It's compatible with iOS 6. Uh, I'm using iPod Touch 5th generation, so you're just going to install it. And then you're going to reload the springboard. And then once you've resprung, here if you pull down your notification center, as you can see, it's nothing, doesn't look like anything now. So we're going to have to enable it by going into our settings. Now, to enable it, you'll have to go up to your notification center, scroll down to the bottom to NC settings, and enable it. From here, scroll down to where it has your NC settings here. Now you can set it, you can set your toggles, um, and as you can see here, if you don't want this on, you can just drag it down here to the off category. And then you can also there you can also change the theme, and you can change um, like how many icons you want to fit in portrait mode or landscape mode. That's how many fit across your screen. Now, once you've enabled it, pull your thing down, and you have NC settings right here. You can scroll like this, and if you're in landscape mode, which I can't do because I'm not using an iPad, then it will show the other amount. And you can see here each of these different things, like you can change your brightness like this and it automatically changes back once you're done you can change your sound boom goes back you can respring location lock all this other kind of stuff Bluetooth it's a very very nice alternative to SB settings so I hope you enjoyed don't forget to rate subscribe and comment